Hello, my name is Artie Zopi, and welcome to week six of the UH Esports Weekly Roundup. Our Strats from Manhattan Valorant Community Night last Friday was a huge success. Big shout out to everyone who came and to Blizzards for making the promo material. He's been helping us out with a lot of our social media posts recently, so definitely a big shout out to him. Our varsity teams are really focused on the Gamers EDU conference that's happening right now, and our JV team is getting involved in the Open Division that starts this Saturday. A lot of our Valorant players have started streaming pretty regularly too, so go ahead and check out their streams, link down below. Okay, so for our League of Legends Gold team, they went 2-0 against It's Over Now in the Risen Esports Amateur Tournament. We're now 2-0 and starting the season off right. The League of Legends Black team beat Wyoming on Thursday, and unfortunately they did lose to Nevada on Saturday. But the race for the CLOL playoffs is extremely close, and their match against U of SD will be a big part in determining it on this Thursday. They also play CSU this week on Saturday. League of Legends Black team also made CSL playoffs, and they're going to be playing UBC this Saturday. The win streak continues for the Overwatch teams this week. The main roster just started playing in the Overwatch Collegiate Championship and picked up wins over Western Kentucky University and Oregon State University. They also won their UGC match for the week against Classified. Is the team name Classified, or are we just not allowed to know about it? They have now won four straight matches. Unfortunately, our Super Smash Brothers team lost against the University of Colorado 7-21. The next match is going to be against Marist College on Tuesday at 4 p.m. and it's going to be live streamed with the link right here. Also down below in the description, just below that like button. Unfortunately, the Rainbow Six Siege team season is done. Rainbow Six Varsity lost 0-2 against UC Davis and the R6 JV team lost 1-2 in an overtime map point against University of Alabama White team. Both teams went 2-4 in the regular season, but everyone had fun along the way and will be looking to do other tournaments and increasing our community size. The Call of Duty team worked hard last week in the first round of qualifiers, and unfortunately, they got beaten out very early on, but they will be participating in the final round of qualifiers this upcoming weekend. And finally, some program updates for you. We got some more production tools very recently to help us improve our broadcasting abilities, and uh, soon you're going to be seeing a lot of that in action here at our Twitch page, the official Twitch page of UH Esports. It's going to be also linked down in the description below, so please be sure to follow if you have not already. Thank you guys so much for watching. My name has been Artie's OP, and I will see you all next week.